All right, y'all. This is Willie Bill. Uh, today, what I have for you is uh, this is a wild planet albacore wild tuna. Um, being this an outdoor show, and we do like some survival oriented stuff, um, this is something I want to do because it does not need to be refrigerated. Um, it packs down real small, which is nice. I just realized I don't have any napkins or paper towels out here. Um, and it's got a long expiration date. Uh, this one is expiring in 2020. It's pretty good. Let me show you the front. It's a company with all the wild planet. Uh, says on the back here that this is sustainably pole and line caught. 100% pure tuna and sea salt. The ingredients are albacore tuna and sea salt. A funny thing about this is it does have a warning that this contains fish. Now, if you're the kind of person that purchased this item and then reads the ingredients and that warning, and you are surprised by that warning, put this down right now and go walk off a bridge. Because if you bought fish and you're then surprised to find out that there's fish contained in the fish, we don't need you. I would suspect the majority of the population isn't going to have that problem, though, so I don't think I'm being too mean. Anyhow, this albacore white tuna, uh, 21 grams of protein, averages 1,100 milligram EPA DHA omega-3 per serving. I don't know what any of that stuff means. But I do know what tuna is. I actually like seafood quite a bit. I do not like tuna fish salad. So like that mixed stuff, never like that. Um, so I'm hoping this doesn't taste like that. I don't know what else there really is to do besides uh, besides try it. I mean, packing, that's real nice. It's, it's tiny, and you're getting a ton of protein from it. Uh, so let's find out what's up here. Rip this thing open. Try not to make a mess. It's like a full package. Whoa. Look at that. There's a chunk of fish in there. Pretty good. It smells surprisingly like fish. That's like a little fish turd or something. I don't know what that is. Let's see if I break this off. Oh, wow. It's actually like the grain of the fish. It's not some mashed up stuff. Okay. Wow. Okay. That is surprisingly good. That is surprisingly good. Albacore white tuna from Wild Planet. So this package, it says it's only got uh, this one serving per container, 120 calories. So as far as trying to maintain caloric in intake, if you're uh, you know out in survival situation. This isn't like a super high calories, but it's got a bunch of protein, 21 grams of protein. So for that, it's really good. Um, and it packs down tiny. And as far as packing it out, uh, once this is empty, I'm gonna be able to roll up this little piece of paper and stick it in the bottom of my pack. So um, I'd say I'm a huge fan of that. It's just, it's just a piece of fish. It's a fillet smashed down and stuck in a bag. I like that very much. Now, you want to fancy something like this up, I did come prepared. This might not make sense in your packing needs, but I'm a big fan of fish and rich crackers. So, this will up the caloric value. Oh shit. Okay y'all, B 
Be careful, there's like goopy, the liquid, the fish juice. Whoa, that's a surprising amount of that. Um, comes run out of package. Maybe it's a good idea to pour, oh, that's off camera, sorry about that. Um, pour the juice out, uh, definitely before you lay the package down. Uh, well, that's why we do these reviews, right? So I can educate the public. Maybe instead of putting a warning on a bag that the package contains fish, maybe put a warning that package contains water. Because when I buy albacore tuna, the fish part I'm expecting. The water part I was not. It does say that there's water in there, but I didn't know it was like run out of the package top water. Okay, let's try that. Oh, look at that. That is a delectable bite right there. Good stuff. A little dry. Maybe a little bit dry. Hmm. Anyhow, um, I don't know if you need me to sit here and continue eating this, but I am for sure going to eat it. Wild Planet, albacore tuna, in a little skinny bag. I'd say that's a good one. Get some of this, you're backpacking, maybe you get some kind of meal, like a freeze-dry thing, and you want to add some fish. This is, uh, this is delicious, so... Uh, that's my review of the uh, albacore white tuna. Subscribe, follow, do all those things. If you got some suggestions, put them in the comments. And uh, till next time, you know, enjoy your lunch. I will.